Well, the Arctic air continues to keep its grip on us, at least for right now, but things will be changing as we move through tomorrow, especially tomorrow night. And tell you what, uh, by the time you wake up Saturday morning, if you walk outside, you're not going to believe the change that's going to be taking place across the region. Outside right now, it is mostly cloudy, and yes, it is certainly cold. Numbers today during the day, we topped out at 23, officially the high shortly after midnight last night at 24, a morning start of 13, and uh, no raindrops, no snowflakes, no sleep pellets out there despite the clouds this afternoon and this evening. Right now, temperatures are a mix of 18 to 19, holding fairly steady. I think this trend will continue for the rest of the overnight. Humidity is 38%. We have an east breeze in here at uh, six miles an hour, so there's a bite in the air, that wind chill flirting with the upper single digits and lower teens across the area. Even with the clouds passing through, they're just some high clouds. You go outside, look up real quick, and then go back inside because it's too cold out there. But you can see some stars and you can see that pale moon kind of shining through that, that overcast. But again, uh, high clouds, so no precipitation close to Louisville or around the viewing area, and we will stay dry on this night. And on your Friday as well, you can see those clouds kind of moving in during the afternoon hours of today. They continue right now, perhaps a little bit of snow flurry activity up there in eastern Iowa. Otherwise, the big weather story for the rest of this night, continue cold with temperatures in the teens, low and middle teens in our northern communities to the middle and upper teens from Louisville and points off to the south. So you're going to wake up to temperatures anywhere from 15 to 20 degrees with some passing clouds. And as we move through the day, yeah, just mostly cloudy. Temperatures a little bit better, a little bit better than what we had today. We will warm into the lower 30s by late day on into the early evening. And you know what? These will also be the low temperatures uh, for tomorrow evening, if you will, because we're just going to continue to climb all night. Big storm system out here in the west as that pulls in our direction. It's going to send a warm front through here. And by the time you wake up Saturday morning, will likely be in the lower 50s, climbing into the upper 50s and lower 60s all throughout. But don't be fooled, that warm air won't last all that long. There it is, maybe a few scattered showers Saturday. Rain chances go up Saturday evening and then change it over to an icy mix, for at least for a short time. A few flurries left over Sunday morning, but we're back in the 20s after high temperatures on Saturday in the 60s. That's crazy stuff. All right. Teens tonight, passing clouds will wake up to 17 in the morning. Midday temperatures underneath mostly cloudy skies for tomorrow will climb to 27. A high will climb up to around 34. And you know what? Those numbers will just rise all night tomorrow night into the lower 50s by Saturday morning. 63, gang, Saturday afternoon. What a turnaround. And then it goes back down into the 20s for Sunday. And then finally things calm down a little bit next week. What would you call that? Fool's cold? What do you think? There you go. I like then, that. I'm just going to tease us, thinking, oh, this is winter. No, no. Here yeah, comes cold. just a tale of two seasons this weekend.